one of the things I want to be able to do is, while I'm working from this end, is to be able to, we already established I can turn the LED lights on. I want to be able to turn the router on manually with a remote switch, and in doing so, turn on my vacuum for the dust collection. So we're going to test out the different pieces to this. So it should all work. I don't have any doubt that it won't work. I just want to make sure. So this is a automatic vacuum switch that works when you turn your power tool on, it completes a circuit, and turns the vacuum on. So the vacuum plugs into this. This plugs into this RF switch, and there'll be a link below if you choose to purchase the same one I did from Amazon. If you do, I'll get a few cents, which is okay. And that will plug into here like this. And then our router tool. Is set to on. Uh, we'll go here. All right. So if I'm over here at the end of the table with my laptop and I want to send a job to the CNC, and before I send that job, I've got to turn my router on and it should also start the dust collection. Nice. So now I'll be able to totally have remote switching. So that works pretty well, I think. Turn the router on. Starts the air extraction. Then I would send the job to the CNC. Job complete. And this is a nice switch because it can tell you, you can set how many second delay you want, if any. So, that's how my setup's going to be. So here I've started the wiring for the uh, X. Need to extend these wires out a bit.
made the decision to mount this thing here.